One of the best things about independent repair shops is that they possess a special combination of expertise, tools, and desire to deliver the utmost level of customer satisfaction. It's no exaggeration to say that small repair shops are uniquely qualified to perform repairs that large corporations cannot, or more accurately, are not interested in performing. For this reason, any business offering that provides value, care, and involves tech is ideal for small repair businesses and allows them to diversify their revenue streams. Today, we'd like to go over a service that we think is a perfect fit for repair businesses. We've seen many examples of these display crafts online. Each provides their owner with a creative and attractive way to preserve their treasured electronics and the memories associated with them. Today's project is an excellent example. It's an iPhone 6S that belonged to the mother of Maya Parts' owner, Mandy. Uh, this is the first phone I got from my mom. And when the phone just came out, she told me that she wants a 6S. So I got her a, this is the first phone I got her. She was very, very happy when she got the phone. It's a rose gold, a very feminine color. And I felt that it's a very special memory between me and my mom. And I think a beautiful memory should be kept forever. If you're a current repair professional, you'll be happy to know that many of the required tools are already in your possession. For this project, you'll need at minimum screwdrivers for your particular device, opening pry tools, B7000 glue or other suitable adhesive, and a shadow box large enough to fit the disassembled device. Additional recommended tools and materials include tweezers, cleaning tools, adhesive labels, and design software. Devices come in a range of sizes, which can make it tricky to know exactly what size shadow box to purchase. You will need to do some research or experimentation to find the right dimensions. But our suggested starting point is a box that has enough space to fit four of your devices side by side. This is because you will need adequate space to lay out the display, back housing, inner components, and any text or graphics all without getting too cramped. Disassemble the device to the desired amount. Depending on your desired layout, you may only wish to include some of the internal components. You may also want to clean each component as it is removed so that it's ready for immediate display. Lay out each component on paper or a surface that's the approximate size of the shadow box to be used. Arrange the components to your aesthetic taste. We recommend not including the battery for safety reasons, but whether or not to include space for screws or text labels is completely up to you. We recommend photographing the layout and then using a graphics program to trace the components onto a document with the same dimensions as the shadow box. This will allow you to fine tune the design as well as add text and decorative elements in the exact locations you want. Make sure to scale the image so that the photograph components are actual size on paper. If you have the right size adhesive labels and a printer capable of printing them, you can print a full layout and adhere it to the shadow box background. Make sure to reduce the opacity of the component graphics so that they're barely visible. This will result in a cleaner appearance once the parts are glued to the surface. Carefully glue each component onto the shadow box using B7000, epoxy, or hot glue. Tweezers are useful for this process as it helps you accurately place and adjust components. Once finished, allow the glue to dry for an appropriate amount of time. In our case, that's 24 hours for the B7000. After the drawing process is complete, you will have a completed shadow box display with a wonderful keepsake safely preserved inside. <gasps> oh my goodness! Wow, this looks amazing! This is like really, it brings up so much of the memories between me and my mom. And definitely I'm gonna hang it in my new house. If you spend most of your time disassembling and reassembling smartphones, then shadow boxes are a great way for you to use your existing tools and skills to deliver added value for your clients. They allow your customers to keep their treasured devices, even if they are beyond repair or if they no longer support software updates. Best of all, it keeps devices out of landfills and helps reduce attitudes and practices that lead to e-waste. If this looks like something you could do, consider adding it to your business offerings.